Welcome to SNN, the Stinky News Network. I'm Whip Stinkington. And I'm Cory the Corpse Plant. Good evening. Tonight, some stinky things smell just like other different stinky things. Like that piece of stinky cheese smells like these stinky socks. Cory, why do some stinky things, like you, smell like other stinky things? Glad you asked, Whip. I smell like dead fish and rock candy, which is exactly how I want to smell. Those wouldn't be my first perfume choices, but I'm sure you have your reasons. I do. It's to attract insects to help me pollinate. I make the same trimethylamine molecules that dead fish make, and another molecule called dimethyl trisulfide. It's found in lots of smelly things like rotting meat and rotting cabbage. Hi there, rotting cabbage. Just like me, you make chemicals that smell like other stinky things too. I sure do. I make a chemical called captain. The same as bad breath. So if everyone with bad breath has ever breathed in your face, well, now you know what I smell like too. That's severely stinkalating. Here's another stinky twin. The pee in dirty baby diapers creates a chemical called ammonia, which makes them smell the same as Haukut, a very stinky fermented shark dish popular in Iceland. And swamps sometimes smell like, wait for it, farts, because they both give off the same chemical, hydrogen sulfide. And the reason stinky cheese and stinky socks smell the same is because of something called microbes. They're tiny creatures so small you can't see them. They live on the cheese and on the stinky socks and make smelly gases. That was a sensational story, Cory. So when one thing smells like another thing, it's because they share the same chemicals. Anywho, smell you later. <laughs> See 